Hello parents, um, it's time for another series recap and this time it'll be about our series on pain. Um, now week one we talked about physical pain and how pain is a way of telling our body that something is wrong and so um, we need to listen to that. Um, but we also talked about the idea that pain and suffering is never God's punishment for us. Um, sometimes there are consequences for actions and if we do something dumb, it'll hurt us. Um, but as silly as it might sound, uh, pain is not punishment from God. But we can often get to the point in our lives if we are suffering that we believe that we must have been doing something wrong. And so I just reminded the students that um, if they're going through some sort of chronic struggle or pain, that it is not their fault and it is nothing um, that God is punishing them for. Then in our second week, we talked about emotional pain and we talked about those emotions that are often difficult or unfun to feel, such as anger or sadness. And we talked about how those are necessary things. Um, God made us human and those are things that as humans we feel. And what's important is that we do feel them um, and how the only way out of those emotions is to go through them. And that if we find ways to numb ourselves or to ignore them, um, they'll only cause bigger problems in the future. And so we need to make sure we allow ourselves to feel our feelings and then to listen to what our feelings are telling us, what that anger is saying. Um, is it standing up for us? Are we being um, made to feel small? Are our boundaries being imposed upon? Um, we need to listen to that anger. And then in our final week, we talked about spiritual pain and the idea of feeling disconnected from God. And we talked about two reasons that that might occur. The first is sin in our life. And we talked about how um, Jonah wanted to go his own way and didn't want to follow God's way. And that just led to this feeling of disconnect from God, of running away. Um, and then we also talked about Jesus hanging on the cross and crying out, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Why have you left me? And how sometimes circumstances in our lives can make us feel as if we are separated from God or that he is no longer there. Um, and really all we did was remind ourselves that um, God never leaves us and that we are his. And that no matter what we do or what's happening in our life, um, God never leaves us. And I quoted um, Jesus talking in John, and he says that nothing and no one can ever snatch us from his hand. And so while we may feel disconnected and feel that spiritual pain, um, God is always right there with us, and we just need to be reminded of that. Um, so that was just a little recap of our series. I hope you all are having a wonderful Easter, and I hope to see you this week at Youth Group. Bye.